Hello friends, this is Manji from evidhati.n. Now we are starting with question number 7 of exercise 5.2. So in this question we have, where will the hour hand of a clock stop if it starts first part from 6 and turns one right angle? Now again we are talking about a clock. So here you have a timing given that it is 6, which is the hour hand, it is 6. Now it is 6 from 1 right angle, so it is now where? ये हमें क्वेश्चन में बताना है। Now, when we talk about a clock, तो one right angle का क्या मतलब है? ये अभी हमने जो पहले क्वेश्चंस करे हैं, उसमें हमने समझा था one right angle equals to three steps। कैसे? जैसे अगर आप twelve से three पे आ रहे हो, तो ये right angle बन रहा है, लेकिन बीच में कितने numbers हैं? Twelve से one, one से two and then two से three means three steps. So similarly, 1 से 4 पे जब हम आएंगे तो वो भी right angle होगा because 1 से 2, 1 step, 2 से 3, second step and 3 से 4, third step. So means at every third step is a right angle. मतलब यहाँ पे ध्यान ही रखना है हम start कहाँ से कर रहे हैं, okay? So coming back to the question, यहाँ पे क्या बने कि that we are starting from six. So let's draw clock first. Twelve, six, three. 9, 10, 11, 1, 2, 4, 5, 7, 8. So start six 6. And turns one right angle. One right angle means clockwise jayenge. So 6 se 7, 7 se 8, 8 se 9. 3 steps means at 9. So from 6 if it turns one right angle it will be at 9. Okay. So this was the first part. Let's come to the next part. Now coming to the B part. B part may have from 8 and turns 2 right angle. Matlab 8 se 2 right angle. So first we draw a clock like this. 10, 11, 1, 2, 4, 5, 7, 8. So kaha se start kare? 8 se. And 8 se aapko 2 right angle kare. So 8 se 9, 9 से 10, 10 से 11, means 11 तक एक right angle हो गया, ठीक है, इसको हम dotted line से बना लेते हैं, so 11 तक 1 right angle, then 11 से 12, 8, 12 से 1, 2, 1 से 2, 3, so means 2 पे आके 2 right angle complete होंगे, also इसको और easy बनाने के लिए हम ये भी देख सकते हैं, that 2 right angle means a straight angle. Because right angle 90 degree का होता है, दो 90 degree के angle मिलके 180 degree बनाएंगे, which is a straight angle. So two right angle means a straight angle. So eight से अगर आप straight angle भी बनाओगे, that will go at two. So this means the answer will be at two. Okay? So this was a B part. Let's come to the next part. Now coming to the Third part. Third part may hai from 10 and turns 3 right angles. So let's draw a clock first. 12, 6, 3, 9, 10, 11, 1, 2, 4, 5, 7, 8. So now it is from 10. Means 10 se abu se do. Sorry. It has to take 3 right angles. So 10 to 11, 11 to 12, 12 to 1. Kitne hue? 1 right angle because 3 steps hai. So, मतलब 1 तक एक right angle, then 1 से 2, 3, 4, 4 तक second right angle, then 4 to 5, 6, 7, 7 तक third right angle. So, यहाँ पे 1, 2, 3, 3 right angles complete करके it has come at 7. So, the answer will be at 7. Okay, so this was our third part, let's come to the Next part. Now coming to the D part. D part mein hai from 7. Means 7 se start karna hai and turns through two straight angle. Yaha pe dhyan rakna hai. Hame straight angle given hai. Right angle nahi given. Straight angle hoota hai. 180 degree ka. Right. Right angle is 90 degree. So jaysi do right angle mein ke ek straight angle bina. That means 90 plus 90, 180. उसी तरह जब हम दो स्ट्रेट एंगल लेंगे, so 180 plus 180 will make 360. 
and 360 degree is a complete revolution. So, if it starts from 7, so complete revolution करके कहाँ पे वापस आएगा? 7 पे ही, right? Because we know full revolution में जिस point से start करते हैं, turn करके घूम के हम उसी point पे आते हैं. So this means if we start from 7, we we'll end at 7 only. Okay, so this was the last part of this question and also the last question of this exercise. With this we complete our exercise. But if there is any doubt, any query, please leave it in the comments below and also do subscribe our channel. Bye bye for now.